Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Empires of Steel episode 11. Last time we left off, uh, we were doing a pretty good job of pushing the Canadians back uh, back onto their territory. So that's what that's what we're going to keep doing. We're going to keep pushing them back. Uh, I know that they're probably all the way down in this area here. <clears throat> Since uh, we aren't running into too many Canadian forces right now, uh, mainly the naval... Uh, has the, has been a problem, but we're trying to build our navy back up. Uh, yeah, we're just going to continue pushing forward and, and trying to wipe the rest of the Canadians off the map. I'm hoping that they're going to start running out of resources soon, uh, is what I'm truly hoping. All right, so Cairo is now under our control. We've gone down with all of these and captured a lot of things that were down here. I'm going to grab these up and actually move them Join with that group here. Enter that iron mine. Let's just get all these pulled up here and then we can figure out what to do with them in a second. There's a pretty massive group here. I'd like to try to get these guys through the mountains. Why don't we... Is there a road right there? It looks like there is. Why don't we take this large group uh, down through the mountains and see what we can't find. We've got him going and capturing food. We're kind of keeping the food well balanced, which is pretty good. Steel is perfectly fine. Oil is on the decrease, however... I'm not too con concerned about that. Looks like we've got some Canadian submarines here. Can I take some shots at them or no? It doesn't look like I can. At least not yet. Alright, these guys showed back up here. Let's add them with this group. And they're doing some healing, so we're going to let that happen. And then we can move this group out potentially. Uh, out there into the battle. Cano. Oh, what do I want you to produce? I kind of want ships, but at the same time. Another ground force over here would definitely secure or ensure that I can take the rest of these cities. Why don't we get another ground force on the uh, getting produced here? Uh, just like that, just to make sure that we can keep... Uh, keep forces moving out of that area there. We're about to finish satellites, which will be interesting. I'm really curious to see how that goes. Um, I think they just basically let us know uh, what's going on here. <laughs> oh, we can get some short-ranged uh, ballistic missiles here, or some nuclear short-ranged uh, ballistic missiles. And it upgrades to a nuclear ICM, uh, ICBM. I wonder if I want to start going towards nuclear weaponry. I'm not entirely sure what the stipulations of that are. UAV tactical bomber. Uh, let's go for that as well. Let's bump this up to 30. Let's get a strategic bomber also queued up for research. Because that's definitely been the bane of my existence is uh, Canada's Navy. We're about to finish up the spy plane, which is good. After that spy plane is complete, let's throw out some... Let's get some UAV tactical bombers out here. We'll use that to deal with the fighting Canada's Navy. I think that'll be pretty good. We're going for both of these food sources, so food is about to be nice and balanced out. Let's see. Well, I want you guys all in the same group here. What's going on? Houston's got a tank there, I see. And you guys are all already slated to attack. That's interesting. Why don't I stop all of you since you're not even fully upgraded? And let's let you guys all sit there for a second. Let's go down here. Uh, we will upgrade all possible. There is no... What is going on? This city is captured. It's producing a barracks, a factory... Definitely needs the barracks so we can get units healed up. After that, why don't we go for the nuclear power plant? Okay, there we go. And that barracks should be finished up. Okay, those tanks pretty much did what they want. That's fine. 
Here we go. We've got our tanks moving down here. They engaged some forces down there. Looks like they dealt with whatever it was, though. Uh, this place is about to finish a factory for robotics. Why don't you crank out? You know, why don't you just produce wealth for a little bit? Yeah, let's get you car uh, cranking out some wealth. Uh, this is kind of acting as a defense force over here. I'm actually going to send them back to uh, Chittagong here and have them heal up. I know I'm butchering all the names of these cities, but I'm not really... You know, it's, I'm doing the best I can do with what I've got. <laughs> let's do a little bit of bombarding. I'm going to keep these all just like that. These tanks here look like they're pretty much going to try to engage Houston. I'm honestly okay with that. Yeah, look at that. We got a fairly large force that tried to uh, prevent us. Uh, they even had some air there, but luckily I had this anti-air SAM vehicle, which made very short work of that. So we're going to definitely bombard and capture Boston, which has a production value of 21. Holy crap. Boston is not messing around. Uh, as for Singapore, let's move out of Singapore and engage this hostile unit here. And these... All these units we have right here. Let's group them back up in Cairo and we'll get them all put into a big massive group and we can sort with them there. Now Boston will definitely be under my control next turn, which will be nice. About to finish out a destroyer class three here. We can start building nuclear short range ballistic missiles or SRBMs, but I don't think I really want to knock one out yet. Pagoda. Mmm, Pagoda, why don't you get me a couple more destroyers? That would be lovely. And then get a robotics factory. Probably could have done that the other way around, but that's alright. Let's keep sending our destroyer down here. We do have units that can be upgraded now, so let's set those up and get that upgrading done. It's all these units in here that I was waiting for earlier. And let's get this group all formed up. And there we go. So now we've got that group. Once these get healed up and upgraded, then we'll move them out uh, on a mission. We're getting our UAV tactical bombers all situated up. Boy, do they have a range on them. But what I really want to check in is on the spy plane here. I want to use the spy plane to start uh, going through enemy territory and seeing what we're really up against. So let's do that. There we go. So I kind of saw, saw a lot of movement uh, there. A lot of units moving in. Cairo, what are you producing for me? Let's definitely get you a factory. And uh, that'll, that'll be fine for now. We have captured Boston. Production value of 21 is very, very good. But before we do that, we definitely want to get a radar factory. Yes, yeah, just go for a radar and a factory for now. And that'll be perfectly fine. Maybe throw an Air Force base up in there uh, once... I can make sure this area is secured and I can fly all these UV tactical bombers down there and be in uh, pretty much in range of every single Canadian city for the most part and do some serious bombing runs. So I think that'll be good for that. And we'll let that unit heal up there for uh, the time being. Destroyer's moving in. Let's keep him moving down south that way. There's some roads that branch off this way. Why don't I take, let's see, this group... Um, they're going to have to go over there and deal with what appears to be some artillery class 4 coming over the mountains. Uh, so we'll start sending them that way. That shouldn't be much of an issue. I'll actually use this tactical bomber here to see if I can't do something about that. As for this group here, they're trying to move out of Singapore because they moved. I moved them out to engage those units. Why don't we put them in this fort here? They should engage these units that are moving across that open, uh, that open forest. I guess not an open forest, but open area which is forest. I want to take Houston, uh, but at the same time, I'll have to worry about this tank coming back into Cairo. What do I got here? A massive force getting built up? I forgot about that. I keep these guys up here. That's a pretty large force. Why don't we send them down this way into Singapore, and then we can start pushing down south. It looks like we're going to wrap this game up shortly, and that's what I'm trying to do right now. Uh, going for a nice, uh, precise victory. Uh, just get a nice kill shot in here. Take these guys out. Well, we still can. 
Uh, for our spy plane, let's of course do some more spying, open up some more uh, intelligence on the enemy here, and see what we're looking at for cities and whatnot. I see Moscow poking out there. Um, Bangdong, Bangdong, it looks like maybe a Chinese uh, Chinese city. Okay, we are engaging them with this force here, which isn't bad. However, I do want to move back into Singapore because we got some artillery trying to sneak up on us. Um, as for this unit over here. Uh, you join that group, or you can't now because you're already on a death march to Houston. Uh, so enter Cairo, and I'll have this unit here. Uh, they're still trying to upgrade, but let's have them engage Houston and just lock that up and be done with it. Because that's what I really want to do right now is I want to engage them and be done with that uh, that unit. Send that other infantry unit down there out to Cairo. They're trying to do some bombing runs on us. Look, they got a SAM right in here, so good luck uh, with that. They're probably not going to make it very far. Spy plane definitely took some damage. Not a crazy amount, but they took damage. Let's uh, fly them down this way. Just clear up all of this black space here. So see if there's anything over there worth sending my units over to check out. And as for research, let's get an attack satellite. That'll definitely make a big difference. We'll go for the nuclear ICBM. And uh, how about some... How about we just keep uh, keep beefing up our ships? Uh, the ones that are going to be important. Alright, steel, oil. It looks like I missed an oil there. That's kind of a bummer. You could always go back and take that with a different force, I guess. Um, I really don't want to reroute him because it's going to take forever for him to go back up there. I already know. So let's just keep going straight with him. And Manila's got another battleship we're going to have to send down anyway. So let's just send him down to capture that. And then maybe we'll route him back up to upgrade, or should I leave him there and upgrade him there now? Now let's set him to uh, let's set him there. I think the game's gonna wrap up soon enough, anyways. As for these guys, let's get them down to Boston. And as for Boston, you're almost done with your factory robotics. Uh, get me some artillery, some tanks. And some vehicles there to help beef up this force if it starts taking some massive beatings. I see lots of troops moving in from the south there. Uh, Singapore is recaptured by the Canadians. That is not going to last very long. as a big force coming in right now. I'm going to take this force right down here. Capture all of this uh, iron that's uh, all through here. And then as for this, uh, my, uh, Houston's about to fall. And once Houston falls, we'll meet back up with these infantry units here in Cairo. Head on down to uh, Shanghai uh, Shang there, whatever you want to call it, Shanghai. The good old SY over here. <laughs> we'll call it the good old SY. All right, factory is about to be completed here. Let's have you produce. Actually, let's get an Air Force base here. Uh, Houston should be close to falling. I got a fairly large military unit moving south through here. That'll clear up these mountains. Uh, Singapore's just going to keep holding it down. Some armor units that are coming up there. Let's grab up my spy plane here. As Does Boston have an air force? They don't. Let's get an air force base. Well, actually. Let's rebase you there. That'll get us a little bit closer. Pretty sure, actually, I never looked at it, but I'm pretty sure they have an Air Force base here. Oop, where are we at here? Houston should be close to falling. Units are healing up. Singapore is... Okay, so what I'm going to do is once this, this Houston's falling, I'm going to move this unit south. And uh, that will definitely make sure... Uh, I can move this unit out of Singapore and we'll just keep moving. Oh, there's Shanghai right there. So that's Shen, Shen Yang then, I guess. Shen Yang, Shanghai is over here. I've been pronouncing that wrong this whole freaking time. All right, let's move this artillery piece down here and deal with whatever's going on right here. As well as take these tactical bombers, start putting them to good use. And we'll actually send them on a course over this way. They should, there should be a way. Somebody told me there's a way to set these up. They'll automatically do like a bombing run. I guess sentry. So if I send them on a sentry over here, that should make sure that they'll... If they come into contact with any enemies in the fog of war, they'll automatically bomb them. Yep. And I saw that happen. There was some bombing going on there. We actually lost a UAV tactical bomber. 
We're on, what city are we on right now? Cairo. Cairo, what do I want you to produce? Um, why not get some of these UAV tactical bombers? Those are kind of cool. The newer ones are, anyways. Okay, Houston has uh, been captured. There's a couple enemy ships out there trying to do something about it, but these submarines are going to clearly be an issue. I wonder if I could route my destroyer to deal with that. I think I'm going to do that, actually, to turn him around and try to deal with that. Um, can I actually bomb the submarines as well? Let's try to do that. Uh, he's captured that oil. Let's keep moving him forward. Uh, Boston's got a somewhat decent-sized group trying to come uh, out, out of the woodworks there. Let's uh, move out and meet them in the field of battle. We'll leave our other three troops there for now. Or our, little, our small little unit of troops there will leave to kind of heal up and uh, protect that area. This is a pretty good bottleneck. If we come down here and capture um, Bang Dung here, we could we could do some serious damage and cut them off. Let's make sure we're going after this guy. Uh, we got a missile launcher here. Why don't we put this missile launcher inside this fort? All right, Singapore, we're going to start moving you down into Moscow. And I want you to move down, actually. Yeah, I want you to move into Cairo. And I want Houston to build two artillery pieces. And after that, a radar, a factory, and a shipyard. A little bit of capturing going on there. Nothing too crazy. That submarine is going to be of uh, annoyance. I can already tell. Moscow has fallen. Very good. We're running a little low on food. A little low on oil. So let's actually deal with that real quickly. Get that out of the way before I forget. Uh, we will sell 1,000 iron for 1,000 cash. Let's buy uh, 400 food. And let's buy ourselves. Did that uh, did that go through? And let's buy ourselves a little bit of oil. Maybe just uh, 200. There we go. Okay, he's going to go up and try to deal with these submarines here. I really hope he can. Uh, I need to do something about those submarines. As for these UAV... Does Singapore have an airport by any chance? I don't remember. It does not. But there's got to be cities closer that do. Moscow by any chance? I'm trying to click on Moscow. Here we go. It does not, but let's get an Air Force base up in Moscow as well as a radar and a factory. And then we've got that unit moving out to... Uh, engage the enemy Canadian paratrooper there. And this unit of guys, let's send them down here. We'll bombard and capture uh, Bain Dung there. And then Shen Yang. Uh, Shen Yang is about to get hit with a fairly large sized group of people in a second. I think, actually, let's send that group for Shen Yang. Let's send this group of infantry down here to capture this oil. And this artillery unit is going after this guy here. We'll just keep sending him up that way. Actually capture that and then come up this way. Something like that. It'll work itself out. And the destroyer is going to go intercept. Manila is building a battleship, but it's going to take a minute. And it's a battleship class 2, so it's not even really valuable. Let's go for two destroyer class 4s. Yikes, here comes the Canadian freaking Navy again up here to harass me. Okay, what do I want you to produce? Let's get some tactical bombers going. Whatever happened to my satellites? How do I deploy those? I know I built a couple, right? 
No Bildor's where? In Shenyang, because I captured that. Get some artillery since we got some enemy coming in there. And then after the artillery, go for a factory, nuclear power plant, shipyard. Uh, as for those forces, I'll leave them there. To act as defense, I guess I'm going to move this tank over into Houston. And this missile launcher over into Houston as well, since it is experiencing... Actually, I'll just set it right in Cairo and then try to do some bombarding there. That seemed to work last time. And for this... Let's see. Where's my other missile launcher? He was supposed to be... He's supposed to be heading over here, so we'll send him off that way. This artillery can more than handle whatever's coming up this way. Um, destroyer should be engaging that unit soon, that submarine unit. I'm only hoping, for the love of God, that it's nothing too powerful. Uh, as for Boston, let's grab our large force here, start marching out, see what we can't confront, and we'll take this force and go capture both of those. And you've got my spy plane. Let's uh, forward. Let's move forward here. See what we come in contact with. And we've got a couple more tactical bombers. Boston, did you build an air base? No. Tactical bombers. I would go for these ships. But uh, they usually tend to be fairly good at fighting my air. You know what? Let's keep them there for now one more turn. Or better yet, let's send them up this way. Maybe we can deal with whatever's up here. And then reroute my artillery. Oh, yeah, we did do some bombing there. And I think the artillery also shot a few rounds off. Sydney, you're about to build a factory, a robotic factory. Why don't we get you... Dang. Some ships would be nice. But you know what? Why don't you go for some artillery? Since we've got a pretty substantially large uh, force coming in here. We'll get some artillery knocked out. Let's start uh, hitting these ships with artillery. What do I got in you? Another tank. Head on down to Cairo. Uh, tactical bombers are being pushed out. And I'm just going to keep those troops there. This infantry unit... Uh, let's march them down this way. I can see there's a force coming up here, and I don't want to uh, get pinched off, although I'm not entirely worried about it. Ah, uh, Bangalore? Bangla is that supposed to be Bangalore? Bangalore? I, I guess we're about to take Bangalore here. Capturing all this. I'm getting a very good... Uh, that spy planes definitely make a big difference. I'm, I'm starting to see what's left, and it's not a lot at all. Um, I think we can have this wrapped up one or two more episodes and we'll have this battle won so long as nothing crazy goes uh, eerie. There's not really much between here and there, so we can actually bottleneck them really well there. Okay, Singapore, you're about to build me some tanks. You're not really the best place in the world, so why don't we get you a factory, an air force base, and that'll help uh, produce, or increase your production a little bit more. Okay, Bangalore is now ours. Air Force Base, factory, radar, p nuclear power plant. And my group of 10 guys here uh, start heading off this way and capturing all these forts there. That should be simple enough. As for my little uh, outpost of three veterans, all veteran units here, uh, we'll go for that iron there and just capture that and make sure that's all locked down. Okay, did that destroyer take that ship out? I'm going to assume no. Because it's not there anymore. There is another Battleship Class 2 coming out of there, but I don't think it's going to be enough. And I'm still producing destroyers, but I just cannot get any type of naval uh, units out without it basically get being obliterated. But let's go back over here and try to sweep these up. Oil's in the positive now, steel's in the negatives. Food is dipping down a little bit more, even though I've captured a lot of food tiles. Um, although I am building up my military fairly large, so it is understandable. Let's actually enter Sin Shenyang here and join that tank up with the other ones. As for you, I simply just wanted you to sit on there and guard me. Oh, you're going for this guy. Okay, I see him. Yeah, just cut straight across there, see if you can get within range of hitting him. You actually could technically probably do it now. But we'll just move across and try to get in a uh, better range for that. Okay, Shanghai is right here, so we could... Let's see, let's keep you moving towards uh, Bendong. As for you guys, why don't we move you out towards this fort here? Capture some oil there. 
lots of uh, entrenched forces there that we just uh, absolutely steamrolled over. Not bad at all. Let's move on down this way. We've actually got a tank here. You know what? Let's have that tank actually enter that fort there, and let's have this unit uh, just stay here uh, until that tank arrives and provides support. Our artillery piece is trying to work his way back here. We'll see if he actually gets it. That destroyer may have taken out that... Uh, I may have potentially have taken out that unit because I don't see... I don't see a submarine coming down here dealing any, uh, doing any problems anymore. So we'll send this destroyer over this way and capture all of this stuff. That should make a, a pretty large difference. Actually, like this. Reroute that there. There we go. That'll keep him uh, fairly busy. All right. As for tactical bombers, <clears throat> I see them coming up on over here. So let's go deal with that. See if we can't take them out. And as for units to recapture that, I don't have any. Uh, so that's obviously going to be an issue, but it's not really actually that big of an issue. Uh, my unit of three guys is here. They're about to move out. Uh, let's just take this small detachment and we'll just head up there and recapture that. Ah, lots of units built up in there. I saw that. We just carved a path with this uh, division here, but holy crap, did they take a beating. Um, almost tempted to reroute them to Moscow uh, and have Moscow start uh, building me some troops to refresh their ranks, although it may not be enough. Mm, I may have to divert this unit down that way. I didn't really want to have to do that. Let's head up and take Shanghai first. Um, as for this unit... Uh, let's start heading, uh, sending them down to Moscow because I think they're definitely going to be needed if this unit does uh, does collapse. Casablanca's right there, so we're going to take this fort here and then push in that way. I can't imagine that the uh, Canadians have very much resources left uh, at their disposal. Boston, do you have an Air Force base? You should now. No, you didn't. I had never built one there, huh? But Moscow should, right? Yep, Moscow has an Air Force base, so let's get our spy plane over here so we can finish uh, spying on the rest of the situation or the situation that's over here and seeing what's going on. But we are out of time for this episode. Uh, these guys are sneaking back up in here, sending a small detachment to deal with that and make sure that we have our bombers uh, queued up to go over here and do a little bit of bombing and see what they can find. And uh, yeah, other than that, everything should be good and set up for the next round. This artillery piece, let's move him into... This area here, maybe we can try to set up some type of defensive perimeter on these forts here to protect uh, people from coming over here, but it shouldn't be too much of an issue uh, anymore. However, like I said, we are out of time, so I do hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you next time.